Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to resolve if the Adobe Creative Cloud is coming across error code msvcp140.dll as well as vcruntime140.dll was not found errors. So it should hopefully be a fairly straightforward process here guys and without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. So first thing we're going to do is open up a web browser. Doesn't matter which one, but for today's tutorial, we're going to open up Google Chrome. And you just want to navigate over to Google. And in the Google search, you just want to type in Visual C++ 2015 to 2019, redistributable. And you just want to search for it. And one of the best results should say the latest supported Visual C++ downloads. Should have a Microsoft domain in the name of the website. So go ahead and open that up. And you want to now select the Times 64 bit one if you're running a 64 bit version of Windows. Otherwise, you would select the Times 86 version. Most of you guys are going to be running 64 bit version, so that's the one you'll download. However, if you're running a really low end computer or a computer I would say older than about 10 years or so, then you would probably download the Times 86 one. So I'm using a virtual machine, that's why it's a 32 bit computer, which is Times 86. I'm going to go ahead and actually run this file now. Select Run if you receive a file notification notice. You want to agree to the license terms and conditions and select Install. Select Yes if you receive a user account control prompt. And it should say setup successful. You must restart your computer before you can use the software. Save and close out of any open programs and applications and then select the restart button. And there you go guys, should be as simple as that. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. Do hope that I was able to help you out and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.